Hey guys, so I wanted to show you because I have the most wonderful grandma in the whole world. My grandma sent me the Too Faced Christmas Grand, Ca Grand Hotel Cafe, the Christmas in New York for this year for a late birthday present and I wanted to share it with you guys. So it came in this kind of box, same kind of confetti stuff that it's packed with. Um, the box looks like this, and then it has everything that's in it on the back, and it is the limited edition dollhouse box for Christmas in New York. In New York. Oh. So, let's see. I make weird faces when I open boxes. So, first thing I noticed, because I heard it slide, is in the box is one of these little things which usually tells you looks to do with the different stuff. So it has four different eyes you can do. And then it has a little information about the Better Than Sex Mascara. Oh, this top of the box doesn't want to So when you take out the actual packaging, it looks like this. It's really cute. It's got a little tree on the back, just like the other dollhouse box did. Um, so you take the little top off and it says Too Faced Grand Hotel Cafe. And then it opens up like this. Opens up like this and there's little trees and there's the three palettes and the mascara. So first it comes with a deluxe sample size of the Better Than Sex Mascara, which is nice. This is a really nice mascara, really good formula. I love the shape of the brush. I have a, sam a deluxe sample size of the waterproof of it. And now I have some normal. Then when you take the three palettes out, for the menu it says the names of the three palettes and it has little stools. And this is magnetic, and I will probably keep this box to keep it in, just because it's so cute. So cute. So the first palette is the Too Faced Eggnog Latte. It has a little miniature on it, and these do, all three of them smell like what their label does, so this one does smell like eggnog. And it really does. And it has a little safety sheet, which we're going to take off. So the first thing is it has this really pretty color called Peach Cobbler for blush, which mine does have a little bump in it, which is probably just an accident, but it's a really pretty color. I really like it. So in, I'm going to go in order from this starting here. It'll This will be the last color. So the first color is called Frosty Nog, and it looks like a base color. And it is, it's just a very pale, kind of neutral color. The next color is Eggnog Latte, which is this pretty gold color. Really, really pretty. And it's just sort of, sort of shimmery, if you can see it. Next is Iced Coffee. Which is this pretty brown, I really like that, that's really pretty. Then there's Skinny Latte, which is just a brown color. I'm like trying to wipe off my fingers in between. Then there's Cold Brew, which is like another really sh- oh dang. Has a lot of shimmer to it, so that's for a really shimmery eye. Then there's Central Perk, which makes me think of one of my favorite TV shows, which is Friends, when they go to the Central Perk. It's this pretty green color. I have to say, I really like this brown shimmery color. Like, that is just gorgeous. So that is the first palette. Next palette is Peppermint Mocha. It smells so good. I love their scented palettes because they just smell so good. Okay, so this one again, I'm going to start with the blush, then go from here. We'll end here. So the blush is called Santa Baby. And this one does have a little bit of, tiny bit of shimmer. So. It's a really light 
light pink color. I'll go over it again just so you can see it really well. It's that. It's really pretty. I like it a lot. The first eyeshadow shade is Peppermint Cream, which is a white color. So I always love a nice white color just because for winter time it tends to be nice. Even though it's fall right now, but it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Next is Christmas Blend. Which is this. It's just kind of a shimmery nude color. Then there's Peppermint Mocha. Which is this color. Next is Candy Cane, which is a very pale pink. But pale pinks are nice to have, especially because I don't have a pale pink eyeshadow, and I need one for tutorials to come. Next is Sprinkles, which is a really shimmery deep pink color, although it's not too opaque. Oh, yeah. Which is right here. It didn't really show up on my hand. Oh no, no, no. It's right there. It looks brown on camera, but it's like a really deep pink. Then lastly is Coffee Chip, which is this beautiful dark brown. That's it for the peppermint mocha. Last we have the gingerbread cookie palette. I'm not a big fan of eating gingerbread, but I do love the smell of it. I think it smells so good. So in the gingerbread palette, we kind of have this bronzer tone. I mean, you could use it as a blush if you wanted. I've seen brown blushes. But um, it's a bronzer tone, and it's called gingerbread. And it is a very light bronzer brown, which I like because I'm very light. So even though it's light, it'll probably show up really well on me. The first eyeshadow color is another kind of base color. It's called Ginger Cream. And it is about the same color as my skin. It's right there. Sorry, I'm running out of places to put swatches. I kind of spread them out a little too much. Next is Maple Syrup, which is this really deep brown color, really nice, good crease color. Next is Ginger Snap, which is this beautiful shimmery orange. I'm sorry, looking at it, it's just so beautiful. Look at that. That is good. Let me show you it in the package because it is just. Like, look how shimmery that orange color is. Beautiful. I love it. I'm in love. Next is Winter Dream, which is a very shimmery purple color, which is also really beautiful. Oh, I love shimmery colors. Shimmery, glittery colors make my day. Next is Cup of Joe, which is an extremely dark brown. It's almost black, but not quite. It looks black on camera, but it's just this extremely dark brown. And next is Black Coffee, which is a black color. It's just a nice matte black. Okay, so lastly I got two samples in the box. And first I got a sample of the Born This Way foundation, which comes with three for whichever comes in vanilla, 
light beige and sand which are actually none of them are my shade sadly so I will probably include this in the giveaway or I'll give it to people who can use it but I might give it to whoever wins my ipsy giveaway because vanilla is just a little bit too dark I'm more of porcelain which is a very or pearl porcelain porcelain pearl or snow on extremely pale and light and have pink undertones so the last thing I got in here was a nice deluxe sample of the shadow insurance which is an anti-crease eyeshadow primer which I'm actually going to buy soon and this is a full tube so that's nice I will be buying a full-sized tube though I don't want to waste it so I'm sorry so that is it that is what I got from my grandma for my birthday I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys soon when my birch box comes bye